What is it? Claw paused on ten minutes. It's going to be one of three. Six hands. Six, six hands. hands. Blame that man there for six hands. Blame that man there for six hands. The final six hands. When then we're finished, we'll get you the full chip count over the uh, over overnight. One of the chip leaders is right there. Mr. Tim Slater is doing very well. So too is Gerard. He's doing very well. We've got some good stacks of building. We've just lost Steve Warburton. In uh, fours against Charles Ace King. So you have the Ace King. He's going with the Ace King. He had the fours. We're down to the final four tables. Graham pulled out the six. Julian Thew has had a second bullet. And he's sat the side of Michael. <laughs> Michael's grinding away round about starting stack all day long. Never got there, never got going at all. So a quick word with Mr. Ian Bryan as he wanders around, looking busy. It has been a good day, but down to the final few hands. We'll get full chip count overnight, but we think Tim Slater and Charlotte will be a couple of the chip leaders, as always, with Gerard right there. Quick way with Ian. Ian uh, great numbers, day one. It's very, very good. It's very, very good. I mean, we've um, started off the game quite slow, 12 o'clock. It's not the easiest time for yeah. people to get here. Um, but through the day, we've had a nice, steady stream of people coming through. Um, this is the actually this is the biggest field of the 500 pounders this year. So credit to Warsaw, credit to the players for coming down. Beautiful weather and all that. Yeah. And all that. Um, but credit to them because this is the biggest field so far this year on the first day. So hopefully, yeah. As per normal on a Friday, we get a good turnout mm. uh, on a Friday. They were more than double down in Port, down in Reading. Yeah, yeah. Uh, well, that's pretty much tends to be around about double. So. If that's the case, then we're looking at 170, 180 runners. So yeah. happy days. And fingers crossed, happy the 50k days. guarantee yet again. I've been, I've been moved aside. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the 50k guarantee. Yeah, Pro yeah, that's that's history. Yeah, isn't it? History, that is. Young again. Good day. Good to be back good in Walsall. Day. Been good vibes, haven't they? All day. It's been good. Yeah, I mean, the same with the Omaha. The Omaha started with eight players, ended with 47. One of the biggest fields for Omaha. Uh, bit, bit of cash action. So it's been a good atmosphere. Been good crack, you know. Yeah. Uh, it was fantastic. Yeah. Anybody who's coming down tomorrow, don't eat the week because the book has been bob on today. You know, as you can see by the new bill. We weren't missing a few pounds, were we? <laughs> not at all, not at all. Well, day one, day one B tomorrow should be a cracker. Yeah, yeah, make sure you're here. Absolutely. If you want to play day one B, this is a place to be. Walsall, but as you can see, players are just about to bag up the chips. And a few chip stacks. Still Langford doing well again. That's, uh, he's back up to round about the 90k mark. But that is just about it for Walsall day 1A, Groundhog Day, starts at 12 tomorrow, ta-ta! Yeah.